Using information and communication technologies, ICT, can be a powerful tool for achieving development in various fields. ICT refers to technologies that enable the creation, storage, processing, and exchange of information, including the internet, mobile phones, and computers. One way that ICT can contribute to development is by providing access to information and knowledge. Through the internet and other ICT tools, people can gain access to a wealth of information and knowledge that can help them learn new skills, improve their education, and make informed decisions. Another way that ICT can contribute to development is by enabling communication and collaboration. ICT tools can help people connect with others and share ideas, knowledge, and resources, which can support the development of new products, services, and innovations. ICT can also help to improve the efficiency and effectiveness of various systems and processes, such as healthcare, education, and governance. By using ICT tools, organizations can collect, analyze, and share data and information more quickly and accurately, which can help to improve decision-making and reduce waste and inefficiency. To effectively use ICT to achieve development, it is important to consider the following. Access. Ensuring that people have access to ICT tools and infrastructure, such as the internet and computers, is essential for enabling the use of ICT for development. One way to do this is through government initiatives and programs that provide funding or resources for the development and deployment of these technologies. This could include providing funding for the construction of internet infrastructure, such as broadband networks, in underserved areas, or offering subsidies or discounts on ICT devices, such as computers and smartphones, to low-income households. Additionally, private companies and organizations can also play a role in increasing access to ICT tools and infrastructure by offering affordable products and services, as well as by partnering with governments and community organizations to support the development of these technologies. Training and support. Providing training and support to help people learn how to use ICT tools effectively can help to ensure that they are able to take full advantage of the opportunities that ICT offers for development. Offering workshops, classes, or online tutorials that teach the basics of using different ICT tools is one way to do this. These sessions can be tailored to the specific needs and skill levels of the participants, and can cover topics such as how to use a computer, how to access and use different software applications, and how to navigate the Internet. Additionally, providing ongoing support and resources, such as user guides and FAQs, can help people continue to learn and improve their skills over time. Integration with other development efforts. ICT should not be seen as a standalone solution for development, but rather as a tool that can support and enhance other development efforts. It is important to integrate ICT into broader development strategies and plans in order to maximize its potential impact as it can enhance cooperation and communication among many stakeholders, which can aid in coordination and cooperation on development projects. Sustainability. Ensuring the sustainability of ICT efforts is critical for achieving long-term development outcomes. This can involve a range of measures, including building local capacity, supporting local innovation, and fostering a supportive policy and regulatory environment. One way to ensure sustainability is to prioritize the use of open-source technologies and solutions. This can help to reduce the cost of implementing and maintaining these technologies, as well as ensure that the community has access to the source code and can continue to develop and improve upon it. Additionally, it is important to focus on building local capacity and expertise in the use and maintenance of ICTs, as this can help to ensure that these technologies continue to be used and supported even if external support is not available. It is also essential to develop and implement effective policies and regulations that support the sustainable use of ICTs for development, including policies on data protection and privacy, and policies that promote competition and innovation in the ICT sector. Overall, using ICT can be a powerful tool for achieving development in various fields, but it is important to consider these factors in order to maximize its potential impact.